Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited come here again with another video. How are you all doing? Thank you so much for always coming by to watch my video. I sincerely appreciate it. Guys, Convention of African Football Awards, Super Falcon Stars, Asasa Oshola, Nadiose Chamaka Nadiose, Anabiodo, and in top three shortlist. But before I go into it, please, you are in the right place. Thank you for coming. I appreciate your love and support. If you are here for the first time, consider subscribing to this channel, press the notification bell, so that you'll be notified each time I post new videos. You are most welcome, and also help and share this video if it is possible. And to all my amazing subscribers, the new and the returning one, appreciate your love and your support. I do not take it for granted at all, the new and the returning subscribers. Please help and watch this video to the end. Give me a thumbs up and share this video if it is possible for you to do. I will so much be happy and, and appreciate it greatly. Thank you one more time. Let's dive into the gist. Conventional African World Super Falcon Stars, Oshala, Nadius, and Biodun in top three shortlist. Several Nigerian female players and the national women team are set to shine at, war, at the award ceremony after making the final shortlist in different categories. Three standout Nigerian players, Asisa Toshala, Chamaka, Nadiosi, and Deborah Abiodun, they have secured coveted spot in the final shortlist for the upcoming CAF award across various categories. The Convention of African Football Review today, the final shortlist comprising three candidates each for all award categories. Aziza Oshola, already is a record five time recipient of the African Player of the Award of the Year, Women Accolade, continues to etch her name in history. The Super Falcons and Barcelona striker finds herself in top three once again, facing off against South Africa's Tembi Gatilana and Barbara Banda of Zambia, where Super Falcons goalkeeper Chamaka Nadius the first shot of the Player of the Year shortlist, she remains in the contention for the goalkeeper of the year honor. Chamaka Nadius is supposed to challenge Kadijat er, Michi of Morocco, and South, Africa, and the South Africans and the Lamini for the coveted uh, showstopper prize. Adding to Nigerian representation, Super Falcons midfielder Deborah Abiodu clinched a spot in the top three of the Young Player of the Year Women Award. She shared the limelight with Comfort Yeboah of Ghana and Morocco's Nessin El Shad. The Nigerian Super Falcons who delivered an impressive performance at the 2023 FIFA Women's World Cup are strong contenders for the National Team of the Year Women are called They faced competition from Morocco, South Africa, both of whom also left a mark on the global stage. However, in a surprising twist, Randy Wardrum, the mentor behind the Super Falcons' excellent World Cup journey, did not make the court for the Coach of the Year Women nomination. The final contenders in this category include Renard Pedro of Morocco, the Sir Ellis of South Africa and Jerry Shabalala of Malen Lodi Sundowns. Shifting the focus to other categories, the Coach of the Year men race features Niga Ali Sisi, Morocco's Ragui and Algeria coach Benchika. Meanwhile, Alia Wadad and Malelodi Sundowns are in contention with the Club of the Year men title, while is every hour sporting Casablanca and the Mamelodi Sundowns five for Club of the Year women. In the highest participant African Player of the Year contest, Super Falcons, sorry, Super Eagles, 
Napoli striker and Victor Osimhen emerged from the from a field of five, setting the stage for a fierce competition against former winner Mohamed Saleh of Egypt and Morocco, Akram Akimi. The winner of each category will be announced at the Convention of African Football Award Ceremony that is scheduled to take place on Monday the 11th of December. Guys, that is all about I have come to share with you at this moment. It's a thing of joy to see that three Nigerian players, Super Falcons players, are in three different shortlists and they are fine for that award. I hope they will smile on, sun, on Monday after the show has finished. Let me know your opinion about this. Shamaka Naduse, or the goalkeeper of the year. Um, Deborah Abiodo, the young player of the year award. And uh, of course, Asisat Oshala for the women player of the year award. Do you think these guys, these girls are formidable enough? Do you think that they are capable of winning the awards? Do you think they are eligible and they merit the award? Let me know. Who do you think will win it? Please put your comment, put your answer on the comment section so that I will, people will see it and they will also enjoy it. One more time, I want to say thank you very, very much. For the love and support that you have you have shown on this channel thank you very very much i appreciate it greatly so consider to subscribe if you have not subscribed press notification bell so that you'll be notified each time i post new videos and to my, all my appreciative friends you've been so so good you've been so so amazing i cannot thank you enough please continue to watch continue to support and continue to share this video all right. Uh, having said that, I'd like to say to you that there's not your head that is not achievable if your mind is set on it. That is to say that if you can dream it, you can achieve it. I say it one more time. If you can dream it, you can achieve it. And that's all, friends, for now. Till I come your way next time with another video, I say to you guys, bye. Bye.